Well, this is your museum curator speaking, uh, David Larson here at the Bug Book Historical Microcomputer Museum. And those of you that have been following the blog pretty much know that uh, I'm a hoarder and been a collector of historical microcomputers for 40 years or more. But uh, this sort of proves a point here how much of a hoarder I am. These old Gerber bottles. Um, first job I had out of college, and I graduated in 1963. That was 52 years ago. Uh, my son was born uh, when I was working uh, that first year at uh, Connell Electronics, marine radio manufacturing, and I was testing marine radio transmitters and receivers. And of course, we used stainless steel uh, hardware because these were going out on uh, boats that were both in salt water and fresh water. And you can see that um, these are probably collectibles for people who are bottle collectors, 52 years old. But more importantly, the hardware we used was stainless steel. You see a lot of number sixes and number eight uh, <clears throat> little stove bolts in here. Well, we, of course, used all that stainless steel, and a lot of it would fall on the floor. Well, it wasn't economical to, to um, you know, to pick up the pieces, so we just swept them up, and I swept a lot of them up and put them in these Gerber bottles, and here I'm 52 years later still finding use. Here's a, model, a bottle of mixed uh, nuts, uh, all stainless steel, and we're still uh, finding use for these 52 years later. Every time I need one, I go and look, and I had a lot more. I've used a lot of them up. But I think you can see from this that, uh, boy, I, I really uh, save a lot of stuff, too much stuff. But it's been very useful, even, uh, you know, almost uh, monthly or weekly, I find a use for wanting a little stainless steel bolt or nut or washer. And usually I can find it in these old 52-year-old Gerber bottles. So this is your museum curator, the hoarder, David Larson. And I'm getting over the hoarding. I'm 76 years old. i got to stop this business and they get rid of some of this stuff. So, anyway, I uh, thought you might enjoy seeing these old bottles and how I just sort of collect everything that comes along and actually find a good use for it.